guys so as you can tell already by the title today's video is a little different one I'm going to give you a list of places that you can get books for cheap so if you like my videos why don't you click the subscribe button down below like this video if you like cheap books and comment down below if you've ever used any of these services so the first obvious one is the library you can check out books everyone has known this since they were a wee little child but what some people may not know is some libraries at least by me offer a little section of books that they are getting rid of or anything that you can buy for like from like 10 cents to a quarter it is awesome I have found some really great books there I found the great Gatsby which I've wanted to read for the longest time and I found it for like 10 cents so that is a really good place to go if you want books quick easy cheap even though you can't keep them and you have to bring them back if you just want to read books it is the awesome place for you to go another really good store to go look at is thrift stores so like goodwill any kind of thrift store people donate books there all the time and you know they may not be in the best condition sometimes but you can find really good books there sometimes for really cheap so another place that you can go they don't have these everywhere but you can go on this website called little free library and look up and see where they are around you they're like these little bitty birdhouse looking things and you open them up and they're full of books I really want to have I really want to get one and put books in it I think it would be awesome but you can borrow a book and bring it back you can exchange for for a book just keep the book cycle going and it's a little free library that people can put in subdivisions or in front of schools you know anything it's just a little free library and it's so it's so cute I really want one of my own the next online or shop place that you can go that I've only personally heard about is half price books I've only heard about this place there's none around me I've never ordered from them online but if there's a store of half price books near you you can sell books back to them and they will give you money back and you can go buy more books I've heard about this and it looks like an amazing place all the books there are half price, really good condition. It's like a Barnes and Nobles, but really, really cheap. Like that's what it looks like inside from the videos that I've seen. So if you live near half price books, go check them out. So there's another store that I've heard about, but I've never been to, and it's called Second and Charles. It is also a used bookstore and cheap books, just like half price books, but they don't only sell books. I've heard they sell like DVDs, CDs, all those types of things. So it's kind of like a thrift store, but it's just those things. And there's one close to me and I really would like to go to it one day. So if I ever go and I like it, I'll let you guys know my thoughts on it furthermore. So the next place is online and it's called Thrift Books. I honestly just bought a book like a day ago from this and I'm waiting for it in the mail right now but I have bought books from them before they're really cheap books that are in really good condition and they're called thrift books and it's just books that cheap and still in good condition so the next place is book depository I think book depository ships worldwide do not quote me on that that is another great place that you can get books for really cheap really good condition really good quality and the last online book place that you can buy books for really cheap that I personally know about is book outlet not a book outlet affiliate that would be awesome but I honestly love book outlet so much I have bought too many books from book outlet okay that is literally where half the books on my bookshelf are from is from book outlet you can find books from 99 cents to you know as much higher but they're normally really really cheap and book outlet has really good sales they just had a sale this past week that was like you buy $30 worth you get $5 off it was something like that don't quote me on those prices but they have really good sales sometimes they put the whole entire the whole entire website for 15% off when it's already like really 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 cheap and they ship I think almost anywhere don't quote me on that either but they're really fast their books are in really good condition and just it is such a pleasurable experience every time I order something from them their books like I said are always in good quality you know my packages don't come beat up or anything that's not that that's their fault that they would but I honestly go look at their website just to go look 
add books. I don't always buy books. I just I keep adding them to my wish list until the next sale. I'm a really bad book outlet buyer. But how can you pass them up when they're so cheap and they're so awesome? That was my video for today, you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed learning a few different ways you can buy books for cheap or just borrow books for cheap. I really love buying books for cheap. That's the main reason that I wanted to make this video was to share the cheap book buying world with you guys because Barnes & Noble, the books are ridiculous, honestly, okay? Unless you, you have to have your hands on a book the day it comes out, I would suggest not buying books from places like that anymore and just ordering them online for really cheap, finding stores that sell them really cheap. Just, they have used bookstores almost everywhere and I think those are better options than Barnes & Noble because money, okay? Honestly, there's nothing better to me than a really nice condition cheap book flat out and that's how I'll end my video today, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Leave a comment down below if you've ever used any of these services and if you would, I'll see you guys later. Bye!